Hey, Courtney Johnson, the Managed Shooter here, and today we're gonna meet my horses. I've got two and a quarter horses. Well, I mean three, but two and a quarter. So you'll see what I mean here in a second. In the meantime, make sure you like and subscribe to this video. That really helps me out a lot. And let's go meet my horses. So the first horse I want to introduce you to this is Copper and she is a registered American Quarter Horse and she is 12 this year and uh, she was my very, um, well she's my second, not my very first, my very second, my second um, mounted shooting horse and she has been uh, my my right hand girl. She's my once in a lifetime. I'm, I'm fortunate that I've got one as good as her. Um, when I did. So she um, really was the one who taught me how to be a mounted shooter and kind of moved up the ranks with me. And I got her when she, um, she was still free. She was my Christmas present to myself. And so her date of transfer on her papers is uh, Christmas Day. And so I got her when she was three and she turned four in the spring. So I've had her since she was a little, um, she was already broke when I got her and great with gunfire and so I just got to do all of the finished work with her which has been wonderful. Um, she is retired. She has um, some navicular problems on her front left foot which we have treated and while I could definitely run her I um, I don't want to take a chance so not worth it. So she is um, a dynamite trail horse and she is just great for letting other people ride. She um, can still do some work and still do a few things, um, but she gets to take it pretty easy. She's getting bred this spring, so that'll be really cool. And I'm excited to get a baby. Everybody's a little sleepy this morning. All right, the next girl I want to introduce you to, this is <laughs> this is Stella. She's not nearly as cuddly and as friendly as Copper is, um, but she's still a really nice horse. I picked Stella up um, four years ago, and she is, I think she's eight, so there's no paperwork on her, but she is, um, turned out to be a really, really awesome mounted shooting horse, even though she wasn't super excited about it at first. And she, um, has really come around and has um, become my go-to gal. She is cranky this morning, <laughs> which is pretty much par for the course. Um, and she uh, really is just pretty awesome. I've enjoyed seeing her come along. She's definitely tested my horsemanship skills, but she's one of several belt buckles and has become just a killer mounted shooting horse. And last but not least, this is Penny the Mini, <laughs> and Penny, oh, hi Stella, hi. <laughs> now you wanna be on camera? Okay, so I bought, um, I acquired Penny, um, I leased her several years ago, and she was just a companion for Stella, um, just because I was taking copper everywhere and I couldn't always take Stella with. So Penny um, was uh, leased to me for a year, and then um, she went back home, and then um, the people that had her, <laughs> stop it, Stella, um, really um, were not, were, um, needed to uh, move on and get rid of their horses and so I said well I'll take her. So she now has a permanent home here at my ranch, um, my little ranch here and oh she's just so cute. She's a little naughty, she's a little bit of a troublemaker but she's a really really great companion and uh, her and Stella are BFFs <laughs> and she's really really quite little. Um, I think she's about 10 there's no paperwork on her, but she's really, really sweet. Um, she, I'm assuming is broke to ride, and I've heard she's broke to cart as well, but I've never done those things, I'm too big to ride her. But she's, she's a little gal, and she's full of personality and punch, and yeah, she's just, 
a character around here. And uh, you know what? I actually haven't measured her, but she's pretty little. She's a little gal. I can uh, I can swing a leg over her, and uh, my feet touch on both sides, so <laughs> touch the ground. But she's super friendly, and she's so cute. Oh, well, Stella, are you gonna be are you gonna be friendly now? Kind of. She looks a little cranky. She's just all business. She's kind of a business girl. And she's uh she's just not the most cuddly. Except when we're at shoots by ourselves. And she realizes it's just me and her. And then she's a cuddle buck. We all have our different personalities, huh? But she's super great. And she's, and she's so pretty. So those are my girls. Um, they are just a fantastic trio and they're super easy to travel with. Everybody loads up pretty good. Penny's a little bit naughty in the trailer, but um, she actually um, has gotten a lot better. So super great and easy to travel with and they're quite uh, the trio. Oh, I forgot I got one more, one more, uh, one more critter, critter to introduce to you. Hold on a second, here he is. All right, so the last member of my circus and probably the one with the most character is this guy back here. This is my cat, this is Loki. And uh, if any of you uh, have met me in person on the road, this guy travels with me. He rides in the truck and he hangs out in the trailer. He really, really loves to travel. Um, and he's just been a really, really awesome part of my little crew of animals. He has his own Instagram, Loki Travel Cat, so go ahead and follow him. I don't update it a ton, but um, he does, does like to travel. It's pretty fun and he's super easy going and he's a mouse and son of a gun. So he's actually probably on his way to look for stuff right now. So um, that is my, that is my circus. That's my crew and poor Loki is the only guy when we travel. So he, I don't think he minds his girls too much though. I think he enjoys it. So thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching and uh, be sure to like and subscribe to this video. That is really what helps me out the most and make sure you uh, follow me on Instagram and Facebook at The Mounted Shooter and don't forget to ride hard and shoot straight. We'll see you next time.